guys, it's me, Sasuke Murray 3, and boy, it seems like we just did this, but okay, we're doing it again. I need to explain this situation really quick because it came up, I think I found the problem, and now on to more stuff. So, my first part of Sonic Adventure went up the other day as of when I'm recording this, and I was pulling my hair out, going mad this whole weekend, trying to fix this problem and find out what the cause was. If you watched the part, then you probably realized and noticed all the terrible frame drops. Oh, it's so bad. There's times it gets down like 10 frames a second. It's it's horrible. I, I can't stand it. I have gone through and tested literally all of my equipment. My mind was that it was my capture card, so I've been talking through the av.io customer service on their forms like, hey, does anyone know about this problem? Could you like help me? Is my card just broke? If it is, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> More like my wallet would cry. The card is expensive. So. I've talked it over with the customer service and it seems we're in agreement that the problem lies with dun da da the cheap cable I bought, who would have thought? When I was looking at VGA stuff, I was like, oh, VGA boxes, and I looked it up and there was like absolutely nothing available. And I saw on Amazon, hey, here's a $15 VGA cable. People say it works great. No problem. Problem. It doesn't output a high enough signal for the capture card. And that is what causes the frame rate problems. And also, why when it hooked up to HDMI, there was lots of screen jittering and stuff that issues, 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 issues. Good news is, it's not my expensive card, and it's a cable. Next problem? The reason I really didn't get a VGA box and got this cheap cable instead was because I found a few and I saw the prices. Because most of them, and especially the official one, were last manufactured in like the early 2000s, you can guess they get kind of expensive. Seriously, if you want like the original VGA box, it's probably gonna cost you about $700. That's stupid expensive. So I spent my morning going through and trying to find a decent box at a good price and I found a modern company that makes these in modern times and they're still not very cheap, but they're not $700. Anyways, I really do want to give quality footage. So I know we just started this adventure, but it's already going on small hiatus because the place that makes them, they don't have an Amazon store and it can take up to 30 days for it to come in. And that's only assuming that this is the problem and that this box will 100% fix it. If it doesn't, I, I have absolutely no idea what I'm gonna do. I, I don't know, but if anything, at least it'll improve like visual quality a little bit. I have a quality issue. I want to make stuff that looks good and is good. And I don't want to point out video that has frame rate issues, especially with video games, because that's a big thing. Sassy, you said you were all ready. I know, I know, I know. I set my mind to it. I said, June 10th, that's the date. We're doing this. We're doing this now. No more putting it off. I have literally spent like eight months working on notes for this. I thought it was all set. I didn't really take note of the problem too much until after I started doing more editing and watching the footage over and over and over again. And that's when I was like, oh, wait a minute. It literally wasn't until three days before the video went up. At that point, I'd already been teasing it and I already recorded three parts and edited all of one. It was kind of a little late to back out. And I still really didn't want to. I am very happy with how this is going and I am excited for you guys to see part two. Part two, I think, is honestly the best part I've recorded so far. I love it. So I wanted to give you that update, and if any of you think, hey, maybe it's not the cheap VGA cable you got off of Amazon, and maybe you should instead try this, let me know, because if this doesn't work, I, I can use all the help I can get, because honestly, me, customer support, everyone here is at a total loss. I would assume that if the video goes fine to your monitor, it should go fine to the card, but I guess that's not the case. So I wanted to give you all that update. Sonic Adventure, I'm gonna get these three parts out. It's Then it's gonna go on a small hiatus until I fix this problem. And then we're gonna start it right back up again. And when I start it back up, I'm going to go ahead and take the first three parts, re-record the cutscenes without the frame rate issues, and then set the original videos to unlisted, and just re-upload these next three parts with fixed cutscenes. I'm not gonna redo gameplay, just so at least the cutscenes are smooth. That's just what I'm gonna do for the first few parts. And then afterwards, shouldn't have to do that anymore, shouldn't have any issues. 
And because this could take a little bit, I think I'm actually going to space out these three parts. So, unfortunately, is that part two airing Friday like I wanted it to? I'm just going to put back on Monday, and part three will be next Monday. Just so it's a little bit spaced out for the time being. I don't. I really don't want to do this. I really wanted to go full hog, and at the end of the week, record a bunch more of it. I was really excited for that. That was my plan. But then, technical problems just smacked you in the face, and what can you say? And instead, this Friday, I'll see if I can get this other video I have put together and out. I really need to do it. It's a cooking video. I've had it recorded for like three weeks. I need to just up and do the voiceover and finish it because it's a bit of a different style than what I normally do for cooking videos, but it'll be that. So, I apologize for this inconvenience. I literally did not figure any of this VGA stuff out until like two hours ago. So hopefully this all gets fixed, nice and easy, nice and simple. This is a completely just rambly video I'm going to have to edit a lot of, but hopefully this makes the point clear. Alright, and I guess that's all I have to say. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one later.